Hi, my name is Dr. Natalia and today I would like to speak about importance of annual health checkups. Some diseases are irreversible, that's why these campaigns are invented in order to prevent or catch up disease earlier. In this video I would like to highlight the most important screening methods and currently available ones. So let's start. First I would like to speak about elevated blood pressure. What does mean elevated blood pressure when the numbers are above 140 over 90? And we call it hypertension. There are modifiable risk factors and non-modifiable risk factors for hypertension development. Non-modifiable risk factors are the factors which cannot be avoided. What does it mean? Race, ethnicity, your age, sex and family history. We cannot do anything with these things. However, modifiable risk factors can be controlled. Physical inactivity, smoking, alcohol consumption, excessive salt consumption, um, overweight and obesity, and stress. The higher your blood pressure and the longer it goes uncontrolled, the greater the damage. Uncontrolled high blood pressure can lead to uh, following complications. Heart attack, stroke, development of aneurysms. Aneurysm is an outpouch of the vessel, which can be easily ruptured. Heart failure, complications related to kidneys, complications related to eyes, trouble with memory and understanding, and dementia. Another screening method I would like to speak is body mass index. Body mass index can be easily checked at doctor's office. It includes measurement of your height and your weight. Based on these parameters, body mass index will be evaluated and if it's found above normal ranges, the patient will be considered uh, overweight or obese. Why it has to be controlled? Because obesity and overweight one of the major risk factors for diabetes development. Diabetes is a reversible disease and once it's established, it cannot be reversed. Uh, third, I would like to speak about importance of uh, blood sugar checkup. By checking your blood sugar, we can uh, detect and prevent development of diabetes. We can catch diabetes at early stage, which we call red diabetes. Uh, now let's talk about blood sugar measurements. Blood sugar can be measured by three different tools. It can be measured in fasting and as well unfasting. So, what the tools in order to check blood sugar? Fasting blood sugar, random blood sugar and glycosidate hemoglobin. Glycosidate hemoglobin shows mean blood sugar within the last three months. Those people who cannot come at early morning and been fasting can easily check their blood sugar by checking glycosylated hemoglobin. With these measurements, we can say whether a patient doesn't have diabetes or the patient is at pre-diabetes stage or at stage of diabetes. Why it's so extremely important to measure blood sugar and detect diabetes? At the diagnosis of diabetes, the changes in different system and organs already persist for five years. As early as we can catch diabetes, we can successfully prevent development of complications related to diabetes. Diabetes can affect heart, kidneys, eyes, and vessels. Those changes are irreversible. There are certain risk factors which increase the risk of diabetes. It includes weight, physical inactivity, family history of diabetes type 2, race and ethnicity, your age, gestational diabetes, polycystic ovary syndrome, high blood pressure, and abnormal cholesterol and triglycerides. Every person above 45 years old has to be screened every three years for glycosylated hemoglobin, or even more often if it's advised by a doctor. As well, I would like to mention about important cancer screening. Some kind of cancers can be successfully screened. What does it include? 
cold cancer can be screened with colonoscopy starting from the age 50 years old and has to be done every 10 years. Breast cancer can be screened with mammography, it's X-ray of the breast and every woman started from 50 years old has to do on annual basis mammography. Screening of cervical cancer can be successfully done with pap smear on annual basis starting from the age 21 years old.